Hey Threadheads, welcome back. I've got a quick little tip for you here today. If uh, you're anything like me and you've started using a lot of the UV resins in your fly tying, and specifically I'm talking about the bone dry product from Solares, um, this is going to be of interest to you. So I've been using quite a bit of the Solares product and sometimes when I get a new bottle and I open it up, the uh, product will be a little bit crystallized and there's two easy ways to fix that. So the first one is what uh, Solares or Wahoo products they suggest is just to take your bottle and put it inside your microwave for about uh, 15 seconds and give it a good shake and that should clear up any of the crystallization in there. This is the one that I use most of the time and I'm just going to put a paper towel under there because some of the uh, resin that's dripped out around the sides and stuff isn't cured and uh, it will liquefy so you don't want to get that in your microwave. Uh, your better half might murder you. 15 seconds. This always makes me a little bit nervous because I'm just uh, scared that it's going to burn the product or it's going to heat too much. So, Alright, 15 seconds is up. Let's go take a look at the product, see how it turned out. Alright, so we just finished uh, microwaving our solar res here. And uh, it's got a little bit of heat in here. You can shake it up. You can hear the liquid in there. So I'm just going to take this paper towel and make sure that kind of clean it off before I open that. And uh, let's have a look, see what we got. Oh, it's perfectly clear. Uh, I did have a little bit of cloudiness on there. You can kind of see everything's cleared up really well. Uh, but I'm going to tell you about another way that a uh, friend of the channel, Hank, told me about. So what Hank suggests is to uh, boil a pot of water and take your Solares and uh, simply put into a resealable Ziploc bag. Now I've got tons of Ziploc bags hanging around from used up different products. Just make sure that you take the label off that before you use it. And this is a 3 inch by 4 inch bag. That one seems to work the best. So let's have a look at the solar is here before. You kind of see it's a little bit gummy and crystallized. So we'll pop that into the bag. Make sure it's sealed up. And uh, if you can, just squeeze out most of the air out of there before you seal it. And then we're going to pop that into a pot of boiling water and leave it for about 15 minutes. Give it a good shake and we'll come back and see what happens. So I've also got a new package of the black Solares. And I noticed as well, when I open this up, it's uh, crystallized also. So what I'm going to do is just do the same thing. I'm going to pop that into a bag as well and try it with the hot water and see what happens. All right, so I got some uh, hot water here, fresh off the boil. And uh, I've got basically just a little vessel here something to keep the uh, um, solar res and I've got them zipped up here so we're just going to go ahead and uh, fill that up alright and we're going to leave that for 15 minutes and we're going to put the black in there let's give that 15 minutes we'll come back and see what happens Alright, so 15 minutes has passed. Let's uh, have a look and see how we did in here. Just want to give it a quick wipe uh, because if there is any of the uh, solar res that wasn't cured, it will uh, run a little bit. And uh, that's part of the reason I like the uh, hot water method a little bit more than the microwave. When you use the microwave, it doesn't really get rid of that material for you. So we'll give that a quick wipe. And you can hear that it's very liquidy now. Let's have a look. And uh, 
Oh yeah, look at that. It's night and day. It's completely clear. We've got lots of clear product in there. I'll show you a close-up of that as well. In the black. Nice and liquidy as well. And how does it look? Oh yeah, very nice. One nice thing about the uh, newer bottles of the Solares also is that they've got much thinner brushes than they had before. And I think I showed in a previous video, trimmed down the brushes a little bit to make it a little bit more accurate in application. But these new ones, super nice, short brushes, um, much easier to get. Uh, a small amount of solar is exactly where you want it instead of having to either trim your brush or be a little bit more careful with how you're applying the solar is. You can use the microwave method 15 seconds or you can put it in a baggie with some boiling water for 15 minutes. They both work great. Hope that helps solve your problem. Thanks for watching. Hey Fly Tires, thanks for stopping by and checking out my Fly Time videos. If you enjoyed the video and want to show your support, hit the thumbs up and share it to your social networks. I hope you consider subscribing to the channel and if you do, be sure to hit the bell icon to get notifications on my latest fly patterns, tips and reviews. If you have a question or comment, leave a message below. You'll also be entered into the next draw for some of the flies I tie and a few stickers. Until next time, this is Darren saying, keep a hook in your vice. Cheers.